Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a praise. Let God be magnified forever in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please find me like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you. As you do that, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah, glory to Jesus. Child of God, your elevation is undeniable. Your elevation, you know. Your elevation is undeniable. Somebody hear me very well. You are being elevated spiritually or physically. And God is saying that that elevation that that is in your life now, spiritually or physically, it is something that cannot be denied by anyone. Even your enemies can't help it. They recognize the hand of God upon your life. They recognize the beauty of God upon your life. They can't help it. Though they don't want to see it, but they are seeing it. You know, there are some persons you show them something, they look at it, they're like, I don't want to see it. But they have already seen it. Why do they use that word, I don't want to see it? Because... They felt that this is not something that they want to see with you. This is not something that they want to see with you. It is either they don't want to see it or they are like, they just want to ridicule it. They want to ridicule you. When you are saying that you are spiritually being elevated, they are looking at it like, ah, spiritually elevated for where they want to say things that will not make you start doubting your growth. Start doubting your growth. Hallelujah. You are being elevated. You are being elevated. When the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, they were like them that dreamt. Child of God, you are being elevated. You know, people look at you, they don't, they don't recognize your spiritual growth. Why? Because you are not a pastor. Oh, you are not a, you don't answer the name evangelist. Oh, you don't answer the name bishop. Oh, you don't answer the name, I don't know, apostle. So they look at you like mm, this one, because a name is not attached to you, they see you as if you are not spiritually growing. Hallelujah. I need you to understand, all this name does not really matter. It does not really matter. You are called a bishop, evangelist, a pastor, an apostle, a prophet, a prophetess. It does not really matter. It does not really matter. Somebody can carry that name and not even be functioning well in line of that name. So because we are living in a world that many people are so blind, they are so blind, they refuse to open eyes. So when a member now said that he's spiritually elevated, the Lord has gifted him or her, they look at him and ah, that one that always sits at the back of the church. You know, that one, that, that man, you don't know that man. That man that sits at the back, at that corner, at the back, back of the church, he was speaking in tongues. Can you imagine? Are you sure that one was speaking in tongues? You know, <laughs> you, you look at this like, what is going on? Okay, the fact that the man is sitting at the corner, at the back, back of the church, he cannot speak in tongues. So if he speaks in tongues, it means that his own tongues is not real. Why? Because he's not at the front seat. Can you see how blind people can be? Oh, because there is a woman who is at the middle, who is in the church, that, that does not belong to Osha, that does not belong to prayer warrior in the group. Uh, he, he said God spoke to her. And somebody is like, ah, that woman. Mm -mm. How, how is God going to speak with such woman? She don't, she don't do it. She's not a pastor in the, the church. She's not this. People are blind. They are blind. They now recognize title more than the real gift that God has given to us. Child of God, this is to tell you that those that want to ridicule what God is doing, using you to do, it is because they cannot help it. Why? Because it is you. It, even your enemies can't help it. They see the elevation because it is something that has become so visible, undeniable glory. You know, there are some glory that cannot be denied. There are some blessings that cannot be covered up. No matter how the enemy tries to say, let's cover it up. It's not covered. It's not covered. It becomes so pronounced. Child of God, you are being elevated. 
and that elevation is undeniable. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.